CCTV cameras are cool and you know what's even cooler? A CCTV camera which you made yourself. You just need to find a wall socket and plug it in. And there you have live feed of your location. If you want to know how to build this CCTV camera, let's dive straight into it. This is the ESP32 camera module, which is basically the ESP32 microcontroller with a camera functionality. Now when you watch it closely, you can see there's no USB slot on the board. So there's no real way to program it, except this FTDI. You need to connect the ESP32 cam and the FTDI with the help of the jumper wires. Here's the circuit diagram for the complete thing. More info can be found in the blog linked in the description. Now connect the USB cable to the FTDI and then to the computer. Now let's learn how to program ESP32 cam module. Mm, go to settings here and then go here in additional boards manager URL. Copy paste this. So basically this is the link and press OK and then press OK here, right? Then go to tools. You can see I already have this installed, but you can install it from the boards manager here. Let it download everything. And then type ESP32 and install this one. So here we'll have an install button and there from there you can install the ESP32 uh, board. Okay, then you can go to tools, boards, ESP32 Arduino and you will have a I thinker ESP32 cam which is here. Yep. So you don't need to mess with these settings. After that, you can go to file examples. You'll see ESP32 and then camera and camera web server. Okay, let's maximize this. Now you need to change two things here. First is you need to select your proper board. For me, it is not this one. It is this one. So I'll uncomment this. And then I'll type my ID and password, which is right. And then I'll upload the code here. When uploading is done, remove this jumper and reset the board. You can see the IP address on the serial monitor. You need to just write the IP address on your phone's browser and press start stream and you can see the live feed on your browser. And that means our project is working. Now let's just put everything in this enclosure made up of chart paper and acrylic and then glue it together. And this is how it looks in the end. I guess that's it for the video. Hope you like the complete process of making your own CCTV camera with the help of few simple things. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.